In this video we're going to be defining an environment variable in the .n file and we're going to be reading it. We're using the Drupal Composer create project setup. We're going to create a .n file from the default example. We're going to create an environment variable in it and we're going to read it in the settings PHP. So here we have a Drupal instance installed and if we jump to its code base we're going to see that it's something that is being generated with the help of Drupal Composer Create. And if we check the readme file here, we see that with all the goodies, we also have the environment variables based in our .n file. So that's something that comes with this package. So we could just use it and simply what we have to do is first we have to create our .n file because first we just have an example so we would have to copy and paste it and we should of course rename it to simply .n and here we have an example and something that, for example, I always use is a variable that is called upenv. And for example, since here we have dev or local, I just set it to dev. So this is the name of the variable and this is the value of the variable. That's perfect. And now what we can do is we could get it for example in our custom module or in our team or in our settings PHP. I will quickly show you how you could do it in your settings PHP. For example, if you go to sites default and the current settings PHP, if we just open it, what we can do here is we could simply go ahead and say var dump and we could use in order to get the environment variable we could simply use get env and here in quotes we simply put here the variable name so let's go ahead and save it and if we go here and if we simply refresh there we go we're getting the value of our custom environment variable that we just defined in our .n file that's it so if you like this video please check the links in the description like subscribe and thanks for watching